Yes, that's what we do. We're laughing. <laughs> We're laughing. We're having because, fun. Because I love this lady so much. I love her too. Yeah. <laughs> so this is my friend Christina. She is an amazing person. She is um, a life coach. Yeah. And she... Um, has helped me find some products that help me with my health and wellness that are amazing. And um, yeah, she's got um, some amazing tricks up her sleeve, but they're not really tricks. They're natural, they're amazing, they're awesome prices. Um, but what I love about her also is that she's um, not salesy, but she, she really is concerned about looking at the whole person and helping you with whatever your concerns are um, and take you to the next step so that you can be the best you can be. Yes. Yes. All of this. <laughs> All of this. All of yes. This. <laughs> so we had our aprons on and we were going to do a paint pour. Um, uh, Christina has been in meetings with me and stuff and she's like, I want to do something like this or she saw this and was totally inspired by the colors and mm -hmm. um, so we've mixed up similar colors plus copper and gold so um, I'm gonna tip our camera down so you can see what we're up to <laughs> okay so now um, we're going to just get paint on the on the canvas this is the background black, black. I don't have a torch. Normally what we do is we'll torch um, the bubbles out of it. Mm -hmm. We don't want the paint to dry necessarily, but we want to torch the bubbles out of it. So this is just playing with paint, just getting to, to go over the edge. Love it. Yes. Playing with paint. Yes. So would you like to play? <laughs> Not over the edge? You, you can get it. Like until the the main surface is covered, and then we'll make it go over the edge. Okay. Oh gosh, yeah, it's a lot of paint. We have spent like, my whole fingers are like black now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we have thinned uh -oh. down this um, the paint. What we're using is Master's Touch liquid acrylic. <laughs> I know it's drippy. Oh, you have black nails now. That's awesome. <laughs> Dip, and we have um, uh, fluid. This is a pouring medium that we've mixed with All right, the... now what? So now we're, we're going to get it to go over the edge. So start scooping it over the edge a little bit. I know. I'm, I don't know what I'm whispering. You don't have to whisper. I know. It's okay. People want to hear you. <laughs> so weird. You need to concentrate. Right. Like, it's all right. It's all right. Good, okay. man. <laughs> Good in the hood. Good in the hood. It reminds me of Fort Hood. So, Christina is originally from Germany. Germany. And we. If you know it with the accent, that's why. <laughs> yes, no, it's a beautiful accent. And um, her husband is, he's not retired yet, though. No. From the army. Yes. Um, and that's how they met. Was, he was in Germany. He was in Germany. There's a chunky bit. We don't need chunky bits. Okay. Yeah, we're good. So now, this is... You're going in. I'm going in. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Just, I do this along the edges to kind of paint the edges and get the paint to flow. So, um, if you remember in... Uh, is it chemistry? Yeah, it's chemistry. Where you learn about the molecular makeup of the of water mm -hmm. and different elements and things. Well, water is H two O, and the um, I think it's the electrons. The number of electrons make something positive or negative, mm -hmm. and water is very off balance. Like, and and it's sticky. Like, the water molecules like each other. They, and that's what how they form droplets and things like that. But I remember that with painting because um, Can I like sure it's it's actually kind of groovy. So I remember that with painting because wet flows to wet. So that's what we do when we're doing our painting adventures is that 
if I want the the paint to flow over the canvas, the dry canvas, I get it wet first and the paint flows better. Hmm. So that's interesting. It is. So now what we're going to do is um, we're going to play with some colors and make a stripe or a swoosh or a pattern that's fairly connected to the center-ish. And what we're going to do after that is put more black on either side, blow it over and cover it up like a little blankie. Yes. yes. And then we'll start playing with that and pushing the paint around and that's what's gonna make the beautiful swirls and things. All right. So I would say let's just, uh, you go ahead and you lay one stripey, stripe, swirl, swoosh. I'm so indecisive though. Oh. You go first. Okay, I'll go first and then you follow me with some other blues then. This is the end of this color, so patience <laughs> is required. <laughs> so, there's a nice light aqua happening mm -hmm. there. All right? All right, which one next? Um, one of the blues, doesn't really matter which one. Does I'm gonna lay this side. Um, no, or right on top even. So in this go place. crazy, oh girl. Gosh. Go crazy. Go crazy. <laughs> yes. Those are gonna be pretty together. All right, I like and then color a lot. Yes. And the darker one. This darker mm. one is so fun. All right. Nice. Um. So now, um, I'm gonna do some of this black. This black has um, um, silicone in it. And so that's what's going to create cells. Cells mm -hmm. are the little breaks in the paint where you can, kind of like a little window where you can see through to the other side. It's kind of cool <laughs> to see through what's behind it. All right, so I would say on either side of the black, let's do some of the gold and the um, copper okay. that we have. I'm particularly excited about the copper a little bit a little bit man i keep opening this and it's ah okay we're making a mess making a mess that's okay that's kind of messy is good yep i think it's a good day when i get paint on myself oh look this is the end of this jar sorry that's that's what we get at the end of the jar all right at the end of the jar at the end of the rainbow at the end of the rainbow it's a pot of gold or the puddle of there's a gold yeah there you go <laughs> it works okay so um just somewhere i would probably in, keep it in pretty yeah. tight over the top of that black and the the gold the copper has that orangish redness to it and so i'm shaking <laughs> no the other side too yeah why not makes me so happy <laughs> so on either side of that I'm gonna put the black and then it's gonna get loud for a second because I'm going to cover it over like a little blankie that looks right. cool it does look cool we could just leave it like that yeah you want a photo I it? take a picture take a photo days. of it before we change it completely right. you won't recognize it anymore <laughs> can tell I want some more of this color. What do you think? Sure. Yes. <laughs> it's so amazing. That's cool that you can do it like in between. Yeah. Well, I'm just thinking, I'm uh, winging it here as yeah. with most art. I 
I'm so happy. It looks cool. It does look cool. I'm playing. I'm mesmerized. Like, I, I know. <laughs> it's like what, what the copper is doing and everything is so cool. There's more blue somewhere. is amazing. Mm. <clears throat> All right, the little spots. Yes, they're coming. Mm -hmm. Craziness, huh? No white. Mm -hmm. I don't wonder. We're, I, we didn't even put white in there. No. Hi, Capone. Cool. We're just like staring yes, in so. awe. <laughs> oh. I really like the copper. So we could drip different colors around. We could add more colors. But as far as the flow of paint, it's mm -hmm. pretty much coming to its end of, you know, it's flowing go. over mm -hmm. the edges and things like that. So what I do is I start looking around at the edges and I just like, if there's a place where the paint missed, I mm -hmm. finger paint with what has dripped down. So that's what we do. The dripping right here looks really cool. Ah, love it. You can put that in the comments. Yes. So, um, I know that paint is part of a healthy lifestyle. Mm -hmm. um, what else? What do you do to relax? Or what, what is another part of a healthy lifestyle? There's so many parts to it. And everybody really has to find their, mm -hmm. what they like the most. Um, but painting, like just standing here and mm -hmm. looking at it, staring at it, it's like meditative state, right? Right. Um, it's, you're so focused and everything else just disappears. There we are. Hi there. We're back. <laughs> but really, every, like, I love that part. I can't even. Yeah. Remember. And I'm not a painter. Like really? I had really bad grades in school. <laughs> bad grades with art. art. Yeah. Yeah. That's my art. teachers d just didn't understand my art. <laughs> That's okay. Yeah. I think it, it's it's great when you can represent something how you want to represent it. Yes. Oh my gosh. I know we're we're painted. It's a good day. <laughs> but I think even more important is actually just doing it. Yes. So always just do it. Mm hmm. Just put it into action, whatever it is. Mm -hmm. But yeah, healthy lifestyle, really everything, like what I like to teach or help with is mm -hmm. diet, yes. exercise, and exercise, I always has to, have to emphasize this because people think exercise, like get a gym membership and mm -hmm. become like a bodybuilder. No, <laughs> don't. Like I like- Unless walk. it's your thing. Yeah, unless, unless you can do it. Do it. Please go ahead and do it. <laughs> but I like to take walks. Mm -hmm. and. I get fresh air, you get the exercise, and walking does yes. so much for your body. So much. So true. You can actually lose a lot of weight just going for a walk half an hour a day. Mm -hmm. But um, And get your vitamin D if it's sunny out. Yes. Not Maybe in Washington. Not Washington. <laughs> no. Wait till summer. But. 
the five days right? of summer. No, I, I, this week has been really chilly, and yes. so it was, I didn't have time for a walk, but I just went outside and sat in the sunshine. And the only sunny spot happened to be in my driveway, so I was totally okay with that. Blanket. <laughs> yes, I was just like, I'm going to okay. sit outside because I have a few minutes, and yeah. I need to be out in the sunshine, even though it's chilly. Yeah. <laughs> so. So. My camera's yeah. crooked. It's bugging me. No. Ah! Nope, it's it's just gonna be that way. Stay, Sorry, stay, guys. Stay. <laughs> we just have to deal with it. <laughs> deal with it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but I mean that's so. one quick and easy thing that everybody mm -hmm. can do. Even if you have kids, take them. Yes. Like go walk to the it's next playground. I don't care. Something. something I've been thinking about too is that every every stage of life brings new challenges for. Yeah how like if health in and wellness and exercise let's say just pick exercise if that's an important piece of your life which it should be for everybody but every stage of your life um looks different of how you fit that in oh yeah because like i remember like my world changed drastically when i had little kids mm -hmm. and and that how do i get exercise then it looked different then than how I get exercise now. And um, all of those things, like taking time for quiet time and meditation and, and journaling and all of those things um, looked different when my children were small than when they are now. Mm -hmm. But they're still important pieces of my life that I put try to, like when the schedule changes or big life things happen, I put have to put those big rocks in the jar first before all the sand fills it up. Yes. Because the sand can fill it up, you know, yeah. like the the unimportant busyness. I mean, mm -hmm. they can be somewhat important, but they're not important to my health. Yes. Oh my God, so many points you just mm -hmm. made. Um, but yeah, if you have a little kid, I have a four-year-old, almost five-year-old. Oh, oh my gosh, she's almost five. She's getting big. Um, but when she was little, I did yoga at home. Mm -hmm. I could just couldn't leave her. Or we were in Washington, like it's cold here, so. Mm -hmm. Don't always want to go outside. True. Um, do yoga with her, and she wanted to do yoga with me. Mm -hmm. So I already did something positive as a parent, and still that in her. That's you know? beautiful. Yeah. And and you can do all kinds of mindful exercises. I did a video, a workshop with um, a parent coach, I guess, mm -hmm. last year, um, about mindfulness exercises with your kids. So it's oh, really no great. excuse. Yeah. <laughs> you can do it. Yeah. Anywhere, anytime. Yeah. Even when you're like, sorry to interrupt you. No, no. But like on your, on your way to work or drop, drop them off at daycare, school, wherever, make them, and you always have the same route usually, right? Unless mm -hmm. there's something else. Make them or ask them like, do you see anything different today? Or do you see something, do you see the cat or do you see that color or where do you see oh, the yeah different cars you know that's cool like little things like that and they have to focus it's like how your brain works i love it so yeah you, so you just make them more aware very fun little things very um, cool yeah but then back to wellness mm -hmm. a lot of self-care like we talked about it before mm -hmm. we met life yes personal development mindset <sighs> work huge like you I can't even, like, I, I just want to. <laughs> she gets so excited. Yes. It's so freaking important, and you need to take time to, to make time for that. Mm -hmm. Like, yes, read books, but have someone. Uh, Speaking into your life. Yes. Yeah. Ask someone that is where you want to go, mm -hmm. and just take the ideas. And when you talk to them, like, you don't have to do it the exact same way. Mm-hmm. But you get ideas when you talk to other people about it. That is for sure. So I I a hundred percent agree, and I think it's really healthy as well to have. Um, I I consider it like a hand up where you're you're reaching up to a mentor and and asking and and um, looking up to them and and having them mentor you, mm -hmm. but also seeing who's in your life that you can mentor. And having a hand down because we all have something some experience or some gifting or something that we are good at and or a life experience that we've gone through that can help somebody else mm -hmm. and that's that's not to be wasted even if it's not like a hurtful experience but you've come through it and you can see the other side of it that 
is going to give somebody else hope. And so, and, and you can help them, not that they're going to get through it exactly the same way you did, but the way you journeyed through it can, in a healthy way, can help them. And I like, I like that hand up and a hand down kind of thinking where you're, you're not just living your own life to yourself because I don't think that's healthy. No, we are, we, we as humans, we're social beings. Yes. We need to be around people Mm -hmm. like like like-minded people supporting each other Mm -hmm. sharing love spreading love and kindness (laughs) i have that on my shirt you can't see yes (laughs) as soon as our hands are cleaner we can uh, take our aprons off (laughs) yeah and then like like you said supplementation is Mm -hmm. like my thing just because of my own story right and i'm i just want to make it simple for people Make it easy and simple because I know there's yes. so many, there's so much confusion. Like, it's should overwhelming. You, yes. Should you do keto? Should you go whole 30? Should you, mm-hmm. whatever else? Like, mm-hmm. it's crazy, but you can, it's so easy if you incorporate like little things. Mm-hmm. And it's just, you know, the ones a day. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, but that's what I'm here for. You know, make it easy for you. Take the guesswork out of everything. Yeah. It's when it comes to nutrition and I'm I'm not going to make meal plans for you necessarily but I can help you and I know people that could help you with that too. Yeah. So so we're all excited. We've been chit-chatting this morning and we've yes. thinking about doing like a a health and wellness uh seminar where you can come and get different ideas that um you know every at every age and every stage of your life you you're working on something that an idea from somebody else is maybe just what you need yes. um, to to take you to the next level of health or the next level of um, where you want to be. So we're like brainstorming about ideas of how we can get that done in the near future. Yes. And, uh, yeah, it should be fun. So I'm going to bring the camera down so you can take another peek at this painting. It's The cells are developing and it's changed mm-hmm. even in the last few minutes. So let me show you. So check this out. I'll bring it up. I'm I'm being brave, getting my fingers all messy, but it's so very, very cool. It's crazy. Yeah, it's pretty neat. Mm-hmm. So this will continue to change and develop as the painting um, drips dry, but it's not gonna be dry for a couple of days probably. It'll be significantly drier tomorrow and then probably um, I, I'm not going to trust it until about Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> no, trust it no trust it to be dry, but it's pretty cool. So thanks for watching. Isn't that cool? She wants to play with the drips on the, on the plastic, but you know, it's all good. <laughs> I like it all. It is. It's super cool. So thanks you guys for watching. And, um, yeah, I will put the, I put in the description, um the her facebook page so please connect with uh christina there she's awesome if you have any um problems health and wellness problems that you're working on or needing uh, answers to questions i highly suggest talking to her her products are all natural and i've been taking the daily supplements and have amazing results i love 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 them and um she's She's the real deal, you guys. She's awesome. So yeah, I'm turning red. And no, red. no, but she's awesome. Really, oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much for that. But I want to add in, like, if you have a question, I love to do the research. Yes. And I'll I'll give you like neutral general studies and resources so you can educate yourself too. Like you don't have to take it from me. Mm-hmm. So I love doing that. Don't feel like. If you reach out and have a question, like I'm gonna tell you, yeah. oh, no, are you gonna order? Are you gonna She's order? the least salesy no. person you will ever meet, but she truly is passionate about helping people understand their own bodies and help their own bodies get better naturally. So whatever that looks like for you. Mm-hmm. So and we'll find a way. I'm I'm determined. I'm gonna help you find a way, mm-hmm. even if it's not me being the one helping you, and I refer you to someone else. Totally fine. Awesome. Maybe you just need some art therapy. I'm good with that too. I think it's part of a healthy lifestyle, yep. being creative, 
You may not want to get your fingers all messy like me, but you know, whatever floats your boat. But again, I'm here to help you too because I think it's a lot of fun too. Um, everybody needs fun in their lifestyle yes. and creativity somehow. Yeah. Um, and sometimes life gets so busy you have to schedule it. Yeah. Because <laughs> I just read some, sorry, we're making it yeah. way longer, but your inner child is screaming at you and it's the little things like, it might come out as binge eating Ooh. or binge watching TV. And that's when you you should take care of your inner child. Oh, well, and that is like... We just played with paint. Yes. That's the to do it. <laughs> cool. Well, you have an awesome day, you guys, and we will see you later. Yeah. Bye, Bye. guys.